Um, you know, Bunny Warlord catching the upset on Xylo earlier in bracket. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I mean, he's not one to sleep on. Like, he'll come at you with some stuff. Uh, yeah, he's definitely a character specialist. He knows the ins and outs of his character. Yeah. And we see, again, like him mixing with these back airs and mixing up his jump timing. So, But Missing No, not going to let it phase him. Gets right in there, and he gets cooking. Yeah, I mean, Missing Known's also a specialist, you know, he, he really knows his... Uh, okay, that was a very right. interesting interaction with the Gordo there. Okay. Oh, he tried to revenge it there, yeah. I believe. So the he's gonna suck, and then, oh, here oh, comes the revenge. Goes. And the Gordo still lingers, so now Missing Known in a great spot here on this ledge. It takes about 30% to get that uh, revenge off or a grab, so Bunny's going to have to hit him, I think, one more time for that revenge to go away. Oh, he just up, he's through the Gordo with the revenge boost. Oh, he's still smashing that hammer. That's hilariously misleading. Yeah, these guys are scrapping in the corner. Got to be careful. Oh, but that up, that should be a free punish. Missing no, and using that high up B to recover and get the punish and the overextension there. Gonna try and revenge again. He's gotta be careful with those, because you saw Bunny go for a grab there trying to call it out. Yeah. Okay. Alright, I mean, if Missing No can clutch out this, or I mean, if uh, Bunny Wardog can clutch out this stock, he can still be in here. Yeah, but you gotta keep that uh, Missing Known in the corner here. Ooh, I'm gonna up you a little bit high. But he gets uh, away with it. So yeah, Bunny gonna use those Gordos to ledge trap, but Missing Known's still hanging on. Cinderor is a very heavy character. Not gonna die off the top super easily. Same goes for DDD. Both these characters will live for a while off the top. Oh, I really like that mix-up there. Yeah, he delayed it a little bit, got the Gordo ground bound, so he could uh, spit it out just a little bit later. Missing Known put out his back here in the wrong spot. Ooh, 44%. That, yeah, Gordo can just get two hits on you and just cause you to take so much damage. But well, here comes the revenge again, and it, yeah, Bunny's gotta respect that lingering Gordo. These guys are just oh. like... That was 50%. Yeah. That forward air to Gordo did 50%. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't think the Gordo gets revenge boosted, but that forward air just it hits so hard. And he gets the tech chase situation, yeah. gonna get his side B. Very nice by missing known. Ready for that tech chase. Yeah, we've seen both these guys just get a lot of damage off their hits. But I think missing known has just been taking his a little bit further and he's been able to find the kills. That's the big difference maker here. Right. Yeah, missing known just looking a little cleaner. I mean, Bunny's doing some cool stuff, especially with Gordo. Yeah, it's just you got to be able to finish off Incineroar before he gets this rage because, I mean, a couple more hits and Bunny could be looking at a stock loss. But again, nice mix up on the Gordo time to find that grab. Yeah, he tried to inhale it that time, which I think would have worked out if it... Uh, oh, he's going for the Jayhammer. Okay, this move hits on ledge. Oh, yeah, I got up in the shield. Crazy. You do not want to get up in the shield in that move. That was awesome. You gotta respect that move. That move actually, like, <laughs> no joke. We have a player in our region who, on Twitter, he's like, yeah, DDD down be one of the best ledge trapping moves in the game. Everybody clowned him for it. Yeah. But, like, that move is crazy strong. It breaks your shield, it covers a lot of space, and it can hit you on ledge and two frame. Like, that move is very threatening on the ledge, so you gotta respect it. And Missing Owen not able to do it, did the standard give him the shield, and Bunny broke his shield. The thing right. you usually wanna do against it is just go up and attack him. That makes a lot of sense. They're just like, so back and forth. So much green of the clanks. Yeah, these Gordo interactions are the other thing, too. They've just been super, like, <laughs> interesting in this matchup. Oh, I'll go for the oh. forward smash. Oh, but he dodges this. Okay. Okay, hard, okay, hard like... commit. Missing known. You do want to be very careful. There is armor on the swing. Oh, no! Wow. <laughs> what? See, this is why I play projectile characters. Because if that happens to me, right. I just go pew. And exactly. it's, the situation's diffused, all right? Come but as a character like Incineroar, you got to do something. Yeah, you got to go in. You, like, like Buddy Mordor is not afraid to just charge that indefinitely, you know? Yeah, although to be fair, when he is charging past the max charge limit, every, uh, I think, like half second he takes a percent. Yeah. If you want to circle camp DDD like that, right. he might get. He might as well, yeah. No, but, I, I could see the dilemma that was... Plaguing missing known. He was like, do I camp it out? Yeah, do, do I, I camp it? Do I go in? Because, like, the other thing is, there is amount amount of startup on that move, and, like, you can grab it pretty effectively, too. If you have a nice, like, disjointed grab, like a Link or, like, a Pac-Man, you can't right. just go up and grab him for it. He's not going to hit you with the swing. Right. But missing known really doesn't have the option. The thing he could have tried to do is maybe get a revenge mix-up, but that's risky. Oh, and the other thing bad. is the uh, side B could catch it. But we see Bunny is just kind of 
he's caught momentum and he's taking him for a ride. I like that little grab setup with the Gordo. Okay. Ooh. This is a scrap. Okay, nice. Oh, catches him on the platform, teching out. Okay, I like going for the upward swing because he would have had to send him all the way across stage, get that side beat to kill. But the upward, he was already elevated. Right. And he was revenge boosted, I think, so could have taken it. But unfortunately, DDD does live off the top forever thanks to his weight and gravity. Yeah, DDD is a big boy. Oh, oh the late. Okay. Yeah, he has some really good mix up on his Gordo timings, and Missing right. Nolan's getting caught a little bit by him. That would have caught me. I would have been hit by that. I thought that Gordo was behind him. It wasn't. Oh, it should be a yeah, up throw kill. Sidor has like three kill throws in his <laughs> arsenal. I mean, he's a wrestler, you know? It makes sense. Yeah, crazy Ooh, strong nice back throw, but yeah. Down smash is DD's like one of his best wake up options along with that down tilt and up smash. Alright, so I think Missing Nun's figuring out where to poke. He's yeah, he's a get, being a lot more patient in advantage, and that's causing Funny to give himself up with these Gordo throws or with the spot dodge. Oh, but then he commits to that. Unfortunate. Yeah. But I mean, Fun. sometimes you gotta take risks, you know? But, uh... One thing that Bunny is doing is he's getting a little bit repetitive with how he's throwing out his aerials. He's kind of throwing back air out in the same spot every time. Um, he has to be very careful because Missing Known can start catching on. But Missing Known hasn't caught onto that Gordo yet. But that was good for Missing Known there. He avoided ledge to avoid the dash attack two frame because he was dead to that. Right. So he just went high and punished him for it. Oh, nice punish for a Bunny Warlord there. Oh, okay. Oh, all right, look at the punish though. Delayed himself a little bit there. Okay. Oh, I, I would have liked back there. Yeah. You guys but, are starting to kind of fall apart here. Oh, oh he's going he again. <gasps> he just did it. Yo, I'm telling you, it's so scary. Okay, one thing I'd like to see Missy Known do in those situations is you have up B. It's armored. Please use it. <laughs> That's a good point. Yeah. Up B will beat out the situations, and it, cover, it comes in from above, so DDD won't get the swing on you. You'll hit his body before he can start swinging. And if he gets the swing out, you got the armor. You're fine. Oh, it gets down air, though. The scary thing is that, like, so before Bunny just held it, but this time he just unleashed it, you know? So, like, he mixed it up, like, pretty hard. And I think Missing Known was trying to, like, make the read within the read and just got hit. I mean, what can you do? And, uh, I mean, Bunny Royal is playing really well. Yeah. There we go. Turn around, up B. Catch him on the platform, but Missing Known's got a big hill to climb here. Yeah, you Now he's on Legends, not the place you want to be. He didn't go for the two frame, but he can still get you on ledge. There we go. Sees I see that. I see yeah. that. Goes yeah. for the upbeat to challenge it. Good stuff coming out from missing him. Good ad adaptation. Kind of dropping his punishes there, though, and that's not what you need at this time. Oh, okay. He's but fine. He's still living. Yep, he's still got an upbeat. Goes to the ledge. Jumps over that dash attack attempt. Borto on ledge almost killed DDD at 40%. Yeah. Oh, my God. That should be a punish, but the star going to save. Oh, there it is. No. He's still, still fine. Living. We still got upbeat. Oh, oh, but not going to be able to make it back. GG's. Alright, so Bunny and Willard are going to get the upset and take it 2-0. He's going to fight Panquake in winner semis. Uh, let's see. I think S is playing his set. Yeah. Eric, if you want to play uh, Skirty. Kyle, did you play yet? Or oh, wait, no, never mind. Kyle.